in the calm that is this game trying to get at me. There's the peace in the song. But we have to leave soon. Back to the hell. Hey everybody, our fearless here. Welcome back. This is more Pokemon Black and White 2. Last time we explored our route 12 yeah, 12. And arrived here at Village Bridge, listening to some awesome music. This time, we are gonna head to Route 11. Get back on the trail and get back to some and get back to the normal gameplay. Starting with the trainer we're going to avoid. Yeah, there's a bit of there that has Pokemon that we'll see fairly soon. So, inside this house. Yahoo! There's an awful lot of nothing around here, isn't there? We get favored mail. Does absolutely nothing. I like that there's nothing, but sure is hard to share. Welcome to Midwest Iowa. Sorry, welcome to the middle of nowhere where you can't even play Pokemon Go. Tears. Well, as I'm crying, and sadness, and sorrow, and all that stuff, we can start out by, ha by a new Pokemon available here, and that isn't Amoongus. Though Amoongus can be found, you can find Gligar here. Why don't we do a fight you for a bile? I turn my body and mind by standing under a waterfall. Nothing will phase me now. Okay, Chuck. Anyways, Gligar is a Pokemon. Yeah, it's a good Pokemon. It has, def it has good defenses, interesting typing, and yeah. I don't recommend it, because it'll take a long time to evolve. So yeah, the island that you need to evolve it is available on this route, but we need Waterfall to get to it. That really sucks. Um. Okay, good, you don't have that move. That ability. Not very effective, but who the hell cares. Anyways, as a Pokemon, it's alright. So yeah, I would go for Gliscor in the ground shaking spot if you want to run Gliscor because you'll be able to get a lot easier. Plus, you do need to get Gliscor for your scene decks anyways. So it all works out. Gliscor is Bowman's very defensive and has a better move pulls pretty fast and fair attacking. It can learn the pretty weak Fang moves along with Earthquake and a lot which makes it pretty useful. Major shortfall, Gliscor is weakness to Ice and even though Ice-type Pokemon are not that common right now, in the future, eh. Yeah, well, it'll be in a hurting. However, though, Gligar is a pretty decent Pokemon all around. Gligar, eh. I'd recommend Gligar if you want to run Gligar, and yeah. Pretty decent Pokemon. Recommend it. Just get luck trying to raise it. Ow. Take this. Anyways, Trainer Adventures, Temple, and Palpitoad. So, there we go. And Murbidon grew to 43. Nice. What? I mean, how? I met your strength. Here, take this as a gift. Yay, we are still in a sphere berry. Good for Gligars, I guess. Maybe I should train my, my, my body and mind by sending it under a waterfall. Maybe I can get clean while I'm at it. Yeah, I was doing some research. Anyways, right here in this spot, one of these two spots, is another Yancey spot. So if you don't, so if you're still needing to do the Yancey side quest, here you go. Nope, not wanting to call. Got it. So, with that, there's not much else here. So, we're gonna head forward. I know they're trying to hand out po legendary Pokemon for free, but this is just... Jeez. Um... What do I want for this battle? Yeah, Connie. Okay then, so, let us begin. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the legendary Pokemon, Verizzi, level 45. Justified for the ability, Helping Hand, Sacred Sword, Giga Drain, Retaliate. Verizzi is a pretty good Pokemon, though I don't really like it that much. I'll be honest, I much prefer, um, Terrakian and, uh, Cobalion over Verizian. Verizian is a pretty good grass fighting type Pokemon. A lot of weaknesses. And it has very good special defense. Downside is that physical defense isn't the best. I mean, it has decent physical def- Never mind. Take two, but yeah, it does have the best defenses in the world. I take that back. I was gonna say it has decent defense, but no, apparently it got one shot by a Fire Fang. Let's see if it is one shot. Yeah, I know you're retaliating for that bullcrap. 
So yeah, it's a decent grass plane type Pokemon. Not the best in the world. Oh, nice. Uh, I was gonna play dumb, but it looks like I have to start checking Ultra Balls. I guess higher catch rate and such. Yeah, it's a pretty decent Pokemon. A lot of weaknesses, especially to flying, fire, and yeah. It's a good special defensive Pokemon, but physical defense? Yeah, not so great. Well, let's try to catch this thing. Note to self, next time, don't use Fire Fang. One, two, three. Darn. Take 394. No seriousness. R Rizzing is alright. Not my favorite of the uh, fire. Not my favorite of the lot, but still pretty alright. Yes, Giga Drain is going to be a bit of a pain. The reason why it's the hardest is because of Giga Drain. Generally alright for the levels, but honestly, Cobalion will be a better bet for your next gym. Now, can you finally catch for me, please? Ow. Uh, Ember. Crap. Thank you. I accidentally used the wrong move. Oops. Next Pokemon. Faraday, sure. Well, I guess we can finally use Thunder. Yeah, okay, pretty fast. A lot faster than I thought. There we go, that's paralysis. What I was hoping for. Thought the thunder should be good. Really? It's supposed to be like a 1% chance. Compound eyes, why do you fail me? Good enough. Man, Rizzing just does not want to be caught. I guess I'm sure start checking Ultra Ball since Rizzing doesn't want to play nice. No. This is gonna be a long haul. Okay, let's begin this crap fest. One. One. Screw you, game. I'm practically shiny hunting at this point. Come on, Verizian. Stop dying. Stop healing and stop dying. Got it? One. Meh. One. Two. Three. Darn it. Catching legend Pokemon is not fun. This will ever take three minutes or three hours. One, two, three. Three hours it is. You know, for a thing, you're putting in more of a fight than any legend has done since uh, Lugia. Back from the uh, Soul Silk from the Heart Gold Let's Play. One, two, three. Come on. Game, I know you're constantly trying to hurt me. I know you hate my existence and everything. But I don't want to be staying in the next three hours. My Windows 7 only has so much memory. No, I'm never going to be upgrading to Windows 10. It's bad enough I can get hardly get this run on 7. Windows 10, I don't have to reset everything every single time I want to record something. So please, be nice. I said please, damn it. Well, this will be a free episode. Don't have to worry about, um... Well, I can milk this series out even longer now. One more episode in. This is gonna take like three years. One. 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 Run out of everything good. Let's start chucking po Pokeballs, because why the hell not? 
Apparently this game really hates my existence for some reason. One. Well, Frizzy, you've officially caused me more problems than every other Pokemon in this game. In this generation, in fact. And to think you're considered small for a compared to some of the more annoying Pokemon later on. Well, oh, gotta do a Hail Mary. Well, fell down to you. Um, do it for the meme! No. One, two, three. Turn me on to his RNG ball. You are? You are? You here to turn me on? To this horrible RNG? Well, we can have to deal with the uh, evil evil game overlords. You want me dead? You want my head on the silver platter? One, two, three. You actually helped! Good kitty! You actually helped me catch this annoying ass Pokemon that took me half an hour. Legends say this Pokemon can found it opponents with its swift movements. Annoying movements. No, I don't need you to give a nickname. Ugh. And to think that's considered calm, that's calm compared to what's going to happen. Well, I think we're done here, so I'm going to head into town. I just need healing. October 23rd. Okay. Welcome to Opposite City. Yahoo! I haven't seen you since I ran to Encastle City. Are you here to battle Grandpa? Yes, Opposite Gym Leader Drayden is my Grandpa. We're not really related, though. Oh, the gym is that way. Before challenging you, you might want to go to Route 9. So your Pokemon really respect you. I feel how much fun your Pokemon are having inside their Pokeballs. Good luck! All the fun of having to catch legendary annoying Pokemon. Well, I would continue this episode off, but... Okay, I thought there was a hidden item here. Guess not. I was just wanting to get in there. I'm kind of lost right now. Lately, I've been just mentally exhausted. Haven't been thinking straight. That's rude! Well, here yourselves a max potion. 
Yeah, ha 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 ha. Anyways, next up we're gonna come down here. And get ourselves a full heal. Nice. <sighs> Man, I'm just exhausted right now. I think I should probably conclude the episode off. So I can get some time to rest. It's evening, it's hot, I'm tired. I'm down. But never out. So, I think with that, we made pretty good progress this episode. We managed to arrive finally at long last at Opposite City. Cut ourselves an annoying ass Pokemon that took way too long and took way too much energy. Yeah, you can tell I'm just tired and exhausted and done. With Pokemon. Also, I did catch a combi. Timid. Up speed down attack. Well, this game absolutely hates my guts. So I think before I think I probably need to get some rest. So that way we can explore the city properly in the next episode. So next time, Pokemon Black and White 2. We're gonna explore we're gonna explore Opposite City in Route 9. I'll see you guys then.